so this is a basic video on how to program the ESC in, oh, in Exceed Infinitive Pro. So just for starters, let's talk about the whole setup. This is a basic uh, 60 amp ESC, I believe, and it's hooked up to a 3650 kV motor. I'm pretty sure it's just the Hobbywing Easy Run rehashed with the Exceed sticker. Like I said in my unboxing and review video, I took off that sticker because it really hampers the fan's performance. The fan starts running really high. But then again, the fan runs really high anyways just because the maximum voltage is 8.4 on which it can run safely. And this battery happens to be 8.4 volts. And so now let's move on to the actual programming itself. So this is the S10. ESC which has this like this whole section right here this chart yeah. there are base, five basic menu items for setting this up first menu item is running mode which is forward with brake or forward and reverse with brake you have your drag brake force you know anywhere from 0 to 40 percent you have your low voltage cutoff which is you know no cutoff or 2.6 volts, you know, all the way up to 3.4 volts per cell. That's per cell, by the way. Then your fourth uh, section is start mode or the punch or how much takeoff force you have. You have four levels for that. And then your fifth menu option is maximum braking force. So you have anywhere from 25 to 100 percent. Now, all this stuff that's in bold. Let's see if it'll focus. There we go. All that is the default settings. And so, how you set this up is like, make sure that your receiver is turned on, like that. And right here on the side of the ESC is a red set button. So, what you're going to do is you're going to, I'm not going to turn on yet, but you're, while you're holding down that button, you'll turn on the ESC and it'll start, the light will start flashing, but you make sure you keep holding down that button, so, and it works in a manner of flashing light, so basically, like, you just keep holding the button, it'll flash, like, once, twice, for each, you know, section. So, I'm gonna do an example here, I'm gonna set the drag brake force to 10%, now that's that's category, that's section two, and it's program value three. So, holding down the start button, the set button, switch on the ESC, still holding down the button, it's flashing, flash once and beep once. There we go. We have two flashes, and the motor beeps, by the way, just in case if you can't see the light with, during the setup. So now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna press it once. All right, so it was default set at two, so I'm at four right now, but I'll cycle back to two. Two flash, one, two, three. There we go. And then when you're done setting it, you just switch off the ESC and turn it back on. And like I mentioned, this fan spins really high at the maximum voltage that it's allowed, you know, 8.4. And they say they tell you even though you can run this setup on a three cell, the they the, you should only run it on a two cell at the time being because that much voltage would fry out this little fan, but you could probably go around different hobby sites, find bigger fans that are made for 12 volts, which is your basic three cell lipo voltage. And by the way, like for whenever you, if you happen to screw up the programming, like one thing you just do is switch on the ESC, you know, don't hold in the set button, and then press and hold the button, and then the ESC will flash three times and it beeps at the same time, if I haven't already mentioned that. And after those three flashes, it resets the 
ESC settings to the factory defaults. So these little guys right here. All right. And hopefully that was a informative one, and hopefully I didn't repeat too much. I do these things on the fly. It's unscripted, so like if anything I forget, like I'll just post it in the video description, or if you ask me, I'll look it up and tell you later. But other than that. There you go.